Hi, welcome to Lynch's Pharmacy video series. I'm Garvin. This video is about Tavanic. Tavanic, or the chemical name levofloxacin, is a quinolone antibiotic. <coughs> and the reason why we take it, levofloxacin, is given to treat a bacterial infection. It is useful for treating infections such as sinusitis, chest infections, urine infections, and some skin and soft tissue infections. It works by killing the bacteria which are the cause of the infection. So in order to best take it, you take levofloxacin exactly as your doctor tells you to. The usual dose is 500 milligrams daily, although for some types of infection, a dose of 250 milligram daily is sufficient. And for others, 500 milligram twice daily is needed. Read the label carefully to make sure you know what dose is right for you. You can take levofloxacin before or after meals. If you're taking one dose a day, it is preferable to take it in the morning. If you're taking more than one dose a day, try to space out your doses. So ideally, take a tablet every 12 hours. Many people find it helps to swallow the tablets with a drink of water. You may break the tablets in half along the score line if needed, but do not crush or chew the tablets. Do not take indigestion remedies like antacids or medicines containing iron or zinc, such as multivitamin tablets, during the two hours before you take levofloxacin or during the two hours after you've taken the dose. This is because these medicines interfere with the way levofloxacin is absorbed by your body and stop it from working fully. If you forget to take a dose, take it as soon as you remember. If when you remember your next dose is due, then take the dose which is due, but leave out the forgotten one. Do not take two tablets together to make up for an earlier missed dose. Even if you feel your infection has cleared up, keep taking the antibiotic until the course is finished, unless you have been told to stop taking them by your doctor. This is to prevent the infection from coming back. A course of treatment usually lasts for 7 to 14 days. If you still feel unwell after finishing the course of tablets, go back to see your doctor. So in order to get the most from your antibiotic treatment. Levofloxacin may cause your skin to become more sensitive to sunlight than normal. You protect your skin by using a sunscreen particularly if you are exposed to strong sunlight for a prolonged period of time. And so do not use sunbeds. If you buy any medicines, check with a pharmacist that they are safe to take with this antibiotic. In particular, do not take painkillers called non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, such as ibuprofen, while you are taking levofloxacin. So some people develop thrush, which is a redness and itching in the mouth or vagina, after taking a course of antibiotics. If you think you have thrush, speak with your doctor or pharmacist for further advice. This antibiotic may stop the oral typhoid vaccine from working. If you are having any vaccinations, make sure the person treating you knows that you are taking this medicine. Levofloxacin may make you feel lightheaded and impair your ability to concentrate. Make sure your reactions are normal before you drive or use tools or machinery. If you have diabetes, you may need to check your blood glucose levels more regularly, as levofloxacin can affect the levels of sugar in your blood. <clears throat> so the main side effects of levofloxacin would be constipation, flatulence, and hyperhidrosis is to be avoided in pregnancy and also avoided while breastfeeding. Also, caution in use any conditions with a risk factor for QT interval prolongation that should be avoided. You speak to your doctor further about this. If you have any further questions, you can ask me through the website through the live pharmacist and we'll answer immediately or email me or call into the pharmacy in Broaddale in Douglas, Cork.